We present a new unsteady Stokes method to accurately treat pressure viscosity coupling in grid-based viscous liquids. Its improved handling of free surfaces lets us reproduce the liquid whoop coiling instability of honey. Solvers based on decoupled pressure and viscosity steps, such as Houdini's, fail to reliably reproduce coiling. Instead, a viscous stream tends to buckle randomly. Even at a higher viscosity, our Stokes approach coils while the decoupled approach does not. Our approach also better preserves sharp surface details in the growing pile. We further demonstrate the detail preservation effect by dropping nine viscous armadillos in a pile. While similar at the coarse scale, the decoupled method rapidly erodes the armadillo's features. Our method ensures divergence-free viscous forces by solving pressure and viscosity together. By contrast, the coupled viscosity methods induce intermediate divergent velocities which are then erroneously projected away, leading to loss of momentum. We demonstrate this by colliding two characters and observing the resulting rate of rotation. A sphere of viscous liquid is rotated along the vertical axis to compare decoupled methods to ours. Here, our method allows energy to transfer more accurately from rotation to deformation modes, rather than being lost during the decoupled projection. Our method also supports surface tension, allowing explicit control over the weight at which sharp surface features smooth away, as seen in this coiling molasses. This example shows surface tension acting to collapse a character in zero gravity. Our method can also handle moving solid boundaries. Here the transparent goo sticks to the ball as it moves out of the liquid. By pouring a stream of viscous liquid onto a conveyor belt, we can demonstrate meandering and coiling. Our method straightforwardly supports spatially varying viscosity as we demonstrate by dropping a block of liquid with high viscosity at one end and low viscosity at the other. We approximate a Twix add, layering caramel that buckles and spreads onto a wafer. We use a variable viscosity to stiffen the fluid as it cools. Thank you for watching.